All right, you lot, don't forget to give us a follow on Apple Podcasts or Spotify. And while you're at it, give us a five-star rating. Trust me, it really does help us out. See, Fernando has been in the news oh, recently because yes. of the uh, oh. social media moment between himself and Lewis. What do we make? Did you see the post that was done? I believe, I believe... Absolutely outrageous. <laughs> we might have a graphic of that post. Of the tweet. Yeah, I believe so. Up on screen shortly. Um, cool. Because, yeah, so basically, <laughs> this was Lewis's... <laughs> this was Lewis's response to uh, Fernando, basically. Now, I have personally <laughs> not verified the article... Jay, you, what, what? Bits and pieces. I mean, Fernando Alonso effectively said that Max Verstappen's titles kind of mean a bit more because Lewis Hamilton only had to battle his teammate. Right. So he's kind of taken away from Lewis Hamilton's title saying, well, you only had to beat Bottas. Whereas Max Verstappen this year has had Poor to beat Valerie, Leclerc. man. <laughs> he's <laughs> like... He's, yeah. <laughs> yeah, if anything, it's a digger. Valtteri That's what I mean. Yeah, yeah, actually. <laughs> he's the man who should really be tweeting. <laughs> <laughs> Just gets his ass cheeks out again. That may be. On the timeline. I, I, be. I don't know, yeah. It's, um, I, I think that tweet's jokes. The thing is about it, and I know a lot of people will go crazy and say, oh, you're, you're being disrespectful, Lewis. But I just like these sorts of things. Yes. It's, like funny. it's funny. It's funny. It's not that deep. It's just funny. It's not, none of it's that deep. Yeah. I don't like Fernando's comments. I don't think they're Even that if deep. it was the other way around, I'd be like, yeah, Bro, it's literally just, yeah. it's just a bit of banter. Do you know it, what I mean? Like, I think stuff between drivers, like, I can't think of many times where it, I've not just been like, you know what? Like, they're sports people, like, their characters, personalities. I don't have, I don't have a problem with that. I think, you know, if drivers are, are, are sh firing shots at maybe their team, that's where I've had, like, Fernando in the past, I, I didn't like the way that he kind of, he was very critical of the team. Even if the team had let him down, I think it's like, this, this team's like, it can be like a thousand people all yeah. sh like working their asses off. I don't think, I, I think when it's like banter between like, these, these guys know each other. <clears throat> yeah. Like, they've been racing together since what, 2007? Yeah. yeah, like, yeah, co yeah. like, come on. Like, it, it's not that deep, I don't think. Fernando's really good at getting himself like people talking about him as well. As, like, <laughs> and I love that side of him. <laughs> yeah. It's great. That's what we kind of like, a, a big part for some people watching F1 is because the raw, unfiltered personalities of the drivers too, right? Mm. Like, compared yeah. to mm. other sports where <clears throat> they're like, pushed away and there's no personality that's what you want to see with f1 you want to see people kind of like you say it's not like malicious it's just kind of like funny the the comments that you're saying in the media yeah. he probably doesn't even mean them and, and also like you know <laughs> we're entitled to our opinions as as fans like the drivers are entitled to their opinions and yeah like sometimes it will like piss someone off but like come on the game is the game it's like, like did you did you see the um mm. the ted kravis um <clears throat> when he was he, he said uh, about lewis scott Cheated or, or some, or yeah. some so he said yeah. in, robbed. In the robbed. I think Sorry, robbed, robbed was robbed yeah. was the words. Key words, yeah. Yeah. Um, it, he said that, and then Max has came out, and I think the whole of Red Bull have come out and said they're not going to do it. Yeah. What? What? Yeah. yeah. What do we? What do we make of that as well? Because I think you know, I think the Alonso, the Alonso Hamilton stuff, like that for me, I don't think personally that too. But I think obviously, when it's it's Sky Sports, it's uh, you know Ted's obviously representing and. You know, obviously, we we know this argument goes both ways, right? There's there's very strong feelings on both sides. I don't know, because obviously Max, you know, he, he he rejected like talking to Netflix as well at the start for Drive to Survive. I think now he's a bit more open to that. But does the driver have? I don't I don't really I haven't really thought about it too much. So I'll leave it to you, lot. <laughs> well, I think it's it's one of those things, isn't it? With like media stuff, and we see it in lots of sports, like. Liverpool and the Sun is the one that always comes yeah. up, right? Like That's pretty much point. every yeah, yeah. single year that comes up at some point. And like, maybe it is just we're going to see Max Verstappen versus Sky and it's just going to be like a, nah, not anymore. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here we I, go. Hang on. <coughs> bit of a sorry. scrap just going a on. A little bit of a scrap there between Gasly and Stroll ended up in the car park <laughs> after, uh, after that overtake. <laughs> Vettel yeah, Vett and Gasly, in sorry. Not oh, was it Vettel? Vettel and Gasly, yeah, yeah. Is it Albon? Is it, right no, it's Stroll. It's Stroll. He's P16. Albon's right behind Oh, my bad. Sorry, I saw Gasly move down. Oh, no. I think it's also tricky, though, with like Red Bull coming out and saying that they're not going to do any Sky Media either. Yeah. Especially when... In like solidarity the, with their driver. Yeah, with, with solidarity with their driver, which I appreciate. But also like the past couple of weeks they've had, they kind of need to come out and yeah. kind of gain some friends again. Because yeah. they've, yeah. they've, uh, they've been a big talking point in Formula One for like probably the last month. Like I've got a podcast and we change the title depending on which team we talk about most. Yeah. And it's been Red Bull <laughs> every single week <laughs> for so long. Because it just feels like they're either at the top 
of the media attention because they're winning things or they're at the top of the media attention because obviously the cost cap stuff, mm. bits and pieces now with Max Verstappen, like they're just always a talking point. Yeah, yeah, I, front I don't, and centre. I don't think like Christian Horner can go a minute without talking to Sky though. Like I feel like he <laughs> loves the camera too much to not he want ha- to talk to Sky. He does do a lot. Of yeah. Sky he's, he, to be yeah, because it's always like we'll go down now to a uh, <laughs> and then a, a, a crew chief down on the uh, down on the pit wall, uh, Christian Horner. Uh, we've got by by some coincidence. 